These aren't cheap. I'm going to show you how we make our own. So we take this plastic insulative cover and run this 12 and a half gauge wire through it. Then we bend the ends on both sides. One side a little tighter, that's where the wire ties. One side a little looser, that's where it hooks on. Or if you want a handle where the electric does not pass through, you can use this handle. You would use this in an instance where you are building a paddock and it butts up against an existing electric fence wire like this. So my fence is not hot, my paddock line is not hot until this makes contact with this. Now this is all electric and hot. As soon as I pull this off, it's not, I can grab the reel and reel up my line. In this situation, we have our paddock line and Let's say it's hooked up on another electric fence somewhere else, but for this specific rotation, this is all we have to work with. Now you can take your line that's electric, hook it up to this handle, and you can hook this handle up to any old fence. The electric's not gonna pass through, so you're not gonna get shorted out, but you can still take advantage of this structure to support this fence. Instead of taking the handle off of the line to remove the electricity, you'll take the other end of this, which is probably going to be a reel, off of the line. Now that's not hot, and you can reel up to this and move this. That's the difference between these two.